Back now with the news story at five. It's only been a few weeks since a helicopter crashed in Williamsburg, killing the pilot and a woman on the ground. Now the helicopter left the airport and then crashed into a condo complex only a few miles away. The NTSB has just released its preliminary report. Penny Assize, Marlene and Ballores saw that and has details for us tonight. What's up? Yeah, in the report, I talked about witnesses saying they saw the chopper moving throughout the sky and then it just nosedived right into that condo building. Now, this happened at the Bristol Commons condo complex on Settlement Drive. The pilot, 85 year old Henry Schwarz, died. A resident, 91 year old Jean Lonchak Daniel Co., was also killed. It happened around 5 o'clock on Sunday, July 8th. Shores left the Williamsburg airport and flew for about three nautical miles before something went wrong. One witness told officials the helicopter looked like it was flying low to the ground. Another witness reported the helicopter was, quote, rocking back and forth unsteadily just before it pitched downward and crashed into the roof of the building. Officials say as the chopper approached the condo complex, it started descending at a rate greater than 10,000 feet per minute. They also say a post crash fire destroyed almost all of the chopper's instruments and equipment. And that crash also started a fire. Now, this is just the preliminary report. The NTSB says it could take up to 18 months to get the exact cause of the crash. We'll have this report posted shortly on wavy.com. I'm Marielana Baloris, 10 on your side.